All right, so there you go. Um, new iCup for the A7S. I used this one before, that was the Hood Eye. And yes, of course, I lost it, so I got a new one. But I kind of noticed a different one. Not from Hoodman, just a generic brand. Uh, I have links below to different versions um, in the US and in Australia and in Germany. Um, but basically, it's the same, same build, so to speak. And it's fairly cheap. It's like 15 bucks, I guess, internationally. In Germany, it's a little bit... Uh, lower like six six or seven euros not quite sure um, and there you have it it's smaller um, it's okay with classes the hood eye still is better if I have it here you know it's quite you know um, um, but it doesn't get a, get in the way of the LCD that much if you have a, like a low shot. It still is a bit, you know, bigger, but not that huge. Uh, and the cool thing, it really is tight and fits really good. You know, not really doesn't come off that quick. So it has the adapter right away. Um, there's no other adapters with that eye cup. Um, and it actually fits quite okay. Um, at first I thought, well, it doesn't really fit, but you have to be a, a bit uh, careful, but also, um, you know, just push it a little bit. But it goes in quite okay. You know, just push it. And the trick here is though, um, not to push it too far down to actually don't, um, you know, the sensor of the LCD EVF thingy is right there. You could, uh, you know, remove a bit of the uh, adapter itself, but actually it works okay if you don't push it down too far, it's just a little bit, you know. Um, and yeah, there, this works quite nice. It still is a little bit too tight. The opening here is a little bit too tight. Would be nice uh, if it, was a little bit bigger so you get a little bit of vignetting so to speak um, you have to look a bit around but it's a bit better than the um, hood eye so there you go um, both solutions are good that one works a little bit better it's still solid doesn't smell it's quite nice so I will try and use this one for the next few shoots and always have this one <laughs> if I if too much Sun comes out so yeah I have links below um, for this nice smaller eye cup it works quite good and it's a better solution maybe not the best still still not the best because this opening should be a bit bigger that would be awesome uh, so someone should make a specific a7 um, I cut that would be nice because we have four versions of this camera right now it's highly used so to speak a lot of people using this one and the uh, eyepiece that comes with that camera still doesn't do the job that good so there you go that's it um, check out the links and let me know if you get yours or if you have a different solution uh, so this is a quick update on the iCup for the A7S. Peace out.